All right, all right, folks. I could not end this day without touching on these scorecards in the Caleb Plant versus Canelo Alvarez. And I know that the judges' scorecards didn't matter because of the ending result being a knockout. But fuck all the dumb shit. You look at these goddamn cards. Take a close look at these goddamn cards. And now when you see Steve Weisfeld, Dave Moretti, and before this fight started, I spoke about that shit. That I don't trust these motherfuckers when they own a car together. And here's me saying that shit before the fight started. I was on this motherfucking face. Plant the fist in his face. Who are these judges? Steve Weisfeld, I can't stand him. Uh, uh, Dave Moretti, can't stand that motherfucker. And here go the girl, Patricia Morris Jarman. I think that's the lady they removed at the last minute from the Deontay Wilder fight. So we got to watch Weisfeld and Moretti. Oh, my God. Russell Moore judging the show, my Fucking God. Holy shit. Caleb, let's beat this motherfucking boy ass because they trying to do something. They need open scoring. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. My heartbeat just went up. Oh, shit, Elizabeth. <laughs> Here come the big one. These motherfucking cheating ass judges. Oh, shit, Elizabeth. Oh, they calling me, baby. Oh, God. They got the cheating this motherfuckers doing this shit. Oh, shit, but I think Kelly will do enough cleaning of his ass to fucking get this decision real good. Okay, with that clearly stated, and knowing what the fuck can happen with these two on the car, and this is also that woman, Patricia, uh, what's her name, Jarmaine. I think she's the woman that was removed at the last minute for Cheatham or one of these two to get on the car because these two motherfuckers, Weisfeld, Moretti, Cheatham, and them are always on fucking big fights together. And when you look at fucking Weisfeld and Moretti's scorecard, they fucking fill these cards out all the same. They only gave Plant two fucking rounds. Well, I see, uh, who is that? Moretti gave Plant three rounds. Weisfeld only giving them fucking two rounds. And their, car, and their cards are almost the goddamn same. Canelo didn't do fucking shit throughout the first half of that goddamn fight. Not a goddamn thing. What the fuck fight was these fools fucking watch? This is why so many people push for the fucking regulation and in, in, in deeper fucking investigations into the sport of boxing's corruption. The corruption levels in boxing are just fucking atrocious. Now, if this fight would have went to the fucking full 12 rounds, they would have robbed Caleb Plant. All for the name of fucking Las Vegas and for Canelo, the money man. He's a cash cow in this game, but fuck all that. These guys do so much to sacrifice going into these damn fights. And this is what these old suit-wearing, old-ass, outdated fucking judges who sit at a table supposedly to fucking score the fight. This, this, this shit that they do in boxing, all this stuff been implemented over the years because boxing has always been, you know, soiled in fucking corruption and, and ill-dealing. Some of the most despicable people involved in the fucking sport the fixing anything synonymous with cheating the sport boxing has always been at the forefront of that shit then you add in other factors such as race and all that shit you deal with uh, uh the financial uh, uh corruptions that are fighters you know being robbed by promoters and everyone else and then you get these judges who are doing shit like this because moretti weisfeld and them are all suspect suspects in this damn game and it's another guy tim cheatham who also is on cars with these cats but fuck this bullshit this shit needs to be looked into and these dudes need to be suspended from this sport for a long fucking time get the motherfucker up out of here but that's all i got man peace